Coach, you guys entered the bottom of the fifth down, five to nothing. Talk about what shifted there and what allowed you guys to make that run. Well, I think it was just key for us to, to you know, to kind of keep uh, whittling away at them, just trying to, you know, keep hitting the ball, putting it in play, and then, you know, eventually they're going to make an error or somebody's going to make a mistake. So that was what was key for us, get a couple base runners and then put a little pressure on them and then saw what happened. We got a few runs there. We got back into the game, which got their confidence back up that they could hit him. So. Talk about what you were able to do today to uh, really push some runs through. Obviously, you were hitting the ball hard. I knew he was a good pitcher. I played with him a few years. I had to hit the ball, show him, show him that I'm a hitter. What did you see on that uh, final pitch where you were able to put it over the fence and win the game? Uh, just stay short to the ball, hit it, try to get the runner in. Uh, you kind of watched it go over there. What were the emotions going through your mind? Uh, I knew that was a ball game. I made a mistake. Just took advantage of it, huh? Yes, sir. Obviously, knowing you know, Donovan as a power hitter, uh, were, you, were you pretty confident seeing him step up there? Um, yeah, I figured at least if he didn't get, if he, if he, you know, I figured he would get a hit. I didn't, you know, I wasn't looking for him to hit one out. I didn't ever tell him to go up there and do that, but, you know, it was nice, though, that he did. But, yeah, if you make a mistake to him, you know, he can make you pay. So it, it's very, um, I'm still surprised he threw a, threw, threw a strike to him like that. So.